substance are not going are not going to just stand by anymore. We are going to. I'm sorry. Let me cut this. All right, straight up, I want to thank everybody for coming here tonight. I want to thank you for the support of getting behind us about the people's proposal for the empty lot behind us. Just a little background about it. It was sold to a man by the name of Robert Carchetta that was supposed to bring a college down here that was actually supposed to create something for our community. Instead, he took the money and ran, and now the money was being spent with the college down at the river. So we're left with basically nothing. We're left with something of leftovers, something that I wouldn't even wish on my worst enemy to have in front of their door. It's an eyesore, it's a nuisance, and it's aggravating. There have been proposals that's been put on the table as far as doing something with this lot, but it did not go to the community to ask them what they wanted to do with this lot. So now we're here today with the people's proposal. So we can be heard on what we want done with the lot. Because let's face it, it doesn't belong to the city hall. It belongs to the residents that live here in Newburgh and that have to live around it, walk past it, and ingest the smells that come from it. At this time, at this time, I'm going to bring up another leader that will be following comments. Um, hello, Andre. I'm Andre. And the people's proposal is based off of a survey taken from 250 plus um, residents in the area. And the, the general consensus based off of these residents is that they would like to have job opportunities. Um, there are about 165 that were leaning towards wanting to have job opportunities. But also, people wanted to have a supermarket in the area at least or to have affordable housing. But I believe that they could have a combination of both to end this lot. Um, <clears throat> there was a secret committee that was formed to finance the six proposals. And the people that sit on the committee, they, they're not, um, they don't live in Newburgh area. They're from the outside. They don't understand what Newburgh needs in this unique uh, financial situation that Newburgh is in. And they don't understand what's going on here. And I believe that the community needs representation, and that's what the people proposal is about. We want to have the community represented in this decision of what is going to be placed in our community behind this line. Um, I'm currently a resident of the city of Newburgh, and I would also just like to state that the residents of Newburgh is also looking to